everyone and welcome back to another one of my videos. Just a little disclaimer, I have no makeup on today, just a bit of bronzer. So if my skin is looking very uneven and patchy, that is why. Uh, it is far too hot today to be wearing makeup, I'm not gonna lie. Like I am sweltered right now sitting here, which is very contradicting because I'm filming an autumn haul. But, you know, we all know UK weather is just completely up the left. So I'm currently sitting here very warm and struggling. So my makeup just would have sweated off. So I've just put a wee bit of bronzer on and I've got my eyelashes done. So yeah, there's no point in me putting a photo face of makeup on to sit here and feel uncomfortable because I wanna actually enjoy showing you what I've got. So today's video is a pre-mark haul. It was actually a very unintentional pre-mark haul. I only went in to get some bits for my mum because it's her birthday tomorrow so I wanted to get her like wee jammies and stuff and I ended up getting stuff for myself. So it's not the biggest haul, I'm not gonna lie, I'm trying to save a wee bit of money so I didn't get as much as I probably could have if I wasn't like saving money but there were so many nice autumn bits like I cannot even explain how much I had to resist not buying stuff. Like I just wanted every jumper and every coat and every cardigan, oh my god. Don't even get me started on the cardigans. I could have bought them over and over again, but I did. I think I spent 102 pounds. Um, but yeah, I got some shoes and stuff too, which I'm really excited about. But yes, if you're excited for today's video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Get yourself a nice wee hot drink if it's a bit cooler where you are. Yes, we'll get stuck right in. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the shoes probably. So the first pair of shoes I've got, I I just can't get over them when I've seen them. Um, so it's these like they look massive, but they're only a size three as you can see. Um, they look really big in that camera. Uh, they're just like this sandy color, and I love the way like the what do you call this bit? Oh my god, there's a wasp. Is that a wasp? Uh, I think it, I don't, I don't know if it's a wasp or a fly. Okay, I think it's just a fly, that, but it is super distracting. Okay, it's away. Okay, right. So, yes, I really like how the bottom bit, like, matches and the laces and stuff. Like, it's all just one colour. And then it's got, like, the wee silver details there. Like, I just think these are so nice. Like... Aren't they absolutely gorgeous? Um, I obviously love like whites and creams and just like really fresh colours. So I thought these would be great rather than wearing black boots. They are like a canvasy material. So I do think they're going to be quite comfy. I haven't tried them on yet. So I'm not sure if they will be. But I'm pretty sure they'll just like feel like Converse. And they're like really sturdy at the bottom and thick. So they will probably last like a good while. Um, But yeah. I just thought these would be really nice with some jeans and a jumper or yeah a lot of things really because of the colour of them. Like they're not like beigey beige, they're like a grey beige. So they'll go with so many different things. And these were £10. Then I picked up a pair of black boots. So I've been on the look for a pair of black boots that are kind of like flat because I've only got ones with like a big heel on them and I just want ones that I can wear like every day. So I picked up these and I do have a slight heel but you can definitely get away with wearing these like all the time um, and they look super nice so they just kind of lace up at the front and they're just like a black faux leather and yeah it's just got that big black heel. These were £16 and I got them in a size 3 um, and yeah I just think they're going to be like really nice for the autumn just a pair of so many different things. I don't actually have a pair of boots like this so yeah, I didn't realise the heel was as high as it actually is, so I'm going to have to try them on and see if they're comfy, because I was wanting something that I can just throw on and be comfy in, so hopefully they are as comfy as I think they're going to be. They are in a wide fit, but I thought that would be great, because in the winter I like to wear like really thick socks, so it means I can put thick socks on and they're not going to be uncomfortable. Yeah, just thought these were so nice. Okay, next up is maybe a wee bit TMI, but I'm going to show you them anyway because they're super comfy, like I couldn't get over them. So it's just, so it's like every girl needs some pants that they're going to wear around that time of the month. And I don't know about you, but I'm not wearing like thongs or anything around that time. So I just wanted like to pick up some pants that were like super comfy and time of the month friendly. So 
I got these. These were six pounds for three, so a wee bit more expensive for Primark, but not expensive at all. So they're just um like I don't even know how to describe them. They're like really stretchy and soft, and they're just they're they're just like a normal pant, if you know what I mean. And I got them in like these blue colours and then grey, black and white and I just thought these would be really good for that time of the month. Next up I got some bracelets, I'm pretty sure these are. Um, so these were just at the door and I walked in and I was like, oh, I need them. Um, I was raging I couldn't find a necklace, very similar, but there's just, there's just two, is there two or three? Three chunky gold bracelets and I just thought these would be really nice to jazz up a wee outfit and um, there were two pounds and yeah can't really go wrong with them. Next up I picked up a coat so this is actually on sale so they had it in so many different colours they had it in black and grey and this colour I'm pretty sure they had it in like a pinky colour too which I was tempted to get but I really really like this one and um, so it's just what's the style of these coats what do you call these? I'm not sure. I got it in a size 10 as the, it was the smallest size they had, um, but I do think this will fit me perfectly anyway. It's kind of just this like sandy colour with like, can you see like the wee green bits through it? Like the darker bits. I do have a coat like this that's like an orangey tan, so it, it's darker and like more of an orangey, like camel colour. So I thought this would be more practical and it feels a lot more the one I have is size 8 and it's from New Look and it's just a lot more fitted whereas this one will be a lot more like comfy to like throw on and it's just got like these lovely wee tortoiseshell buttons and yeah I'm, I'm pretty sad I didn't pick up the grey one because they were on they were meant to be £23 and they're on sale for 19 so that's an absolute bargain like they're so like it's really good quality and like really thick and stuff so yeah, if you do have these in your pre-mark, then definitely check them out. They are grey on the inside. Like, you can turn the sleeves up. I've seen that, like, on one of the mannequins, but I'm not a fan of that. I would just wear it, like, down like that. And yeah, just thought that was an absolute bargain, so I could not pick it up. picked up a jumper so this is actually in the folded section so if you can't find this in your pre-mark definitely check in the folded section so I got it in a size medium and it was £10 and it's just this gorgeous cream cable knit jumper can't go wrong with cable knit jumpers in the autumn and winter and yeah it just has like it's like a plain sleeve and then it has the cable knit detail down the side and I just thought this would be so cosy. I just can't wait for it to be colder so I can wear my jumpers. Like it's really upsetting me. I just can't do this heat anymore. I just can't do this heat anymore. Like it's just not doing anything for me. And I just want I just want jumpers and boots. That's all I want. And it's too warm to wear that. I just love autumn because it's not too cold and it's not too warm and you can just be comfy. I'm just over the heat, I'm just over it. And feeling how soft and chunky and, oh, I just wanna wear it. But yes, this was 10 pounds, so I thought that was an absolute bargain. up this kind of like t-shirt jumpery thing and um, it's like really stretchy and it's just like this ribbed material. I was hemming in hand between so many different ones like there's so many different colours and styles so this was the one I went for. It was only £6 and I got it in size small which is a 10 to 12 and it's just long sleeved. It is going to be super tight. It's going to be one of them t-shirts um, but I just thought this would be really nice to tuck into some jeans. Wait, no, I don't want to play no game. I 
I really want to pick this up in all different colours too, but I just, I don't need any more clothes, like, so I just, <sighs> I'm very proud of myself for resisting. There were so many things I could have picked up and I didn't. I should have done a come shop with me, that's what I should have done, and you would have seen it, you would have seen how amazing everything was, like this next thing I'm going to show you. So. So you've probably already seen my autumn haul with like all the different brands and I got a cardigan similar to this from Boohoo in white but this one, this one's better. I, oh my, it's black so I don't own a black cardigan like this so that's why I got it. Um, it's so soft, like oh, this is so much softer than the Boohoo one and it has a hood. Cardigans with hood or hoods are just gonna be like my new favorite thing to have. Like it literally feels like you're wearing a dressing gown and this is just, it's like a chunky knit material and just so, I don't know how to describe it. It feels like velvet. Like I'm so bad at describing what clothes feel like but it feels like it has pockets. It has pockets. Like, and it was £13. The one in Boohoo was like £20. Like, why did I not just wear it? I'm pretty sure they only had it in black though. But like, this is going to be so, so nice to pair over different things instead of me just wearing white and cream all the time. Um, And I got it in a size 12 to 14 just to kind of make it a wee bit more oversized. I was tempted. I seen one sitting on its own as soon as I walked in and it was an extra large, which is a size 18 to 20, I think. And... It actually didn't look that big. Like I looked at it and was like, I could probably get away with that. Like I was so tempted. And then I was walking around the shop and seeing them away in the corner on their own. And I decided to change it for the medium. But yeah, I'm so excited. You all need this cardigan. Like, I'm, I'm just in awe. It has a hood, it has pockets, it's so soft. And it's 13 mine. I just love Primark. Like, oh, it's just amazing. Ask you it. Lastly, I picked up some jammies. So these were on sale for uh, seven fifty. So I got these, they're super, super soft. I wonder if it says, they're just called like snuggle pajamas. And I got them in a size 10 to 12. And they just have little koala bottoms and a wee pocket with a koala on it and wee pom poms. My dogs are definitely gonna try to them. Um, but yes, these are so, so soft. They're not as thick as the fleecy ones. Do you ever get like a thick fleecy ones on Primark? Sometimes they can be a wee bit too warm when I'm in bed. So something like soft, but like a bit thinner, like these are great to have. And they had these in so many different styles as well. But again, need to resist. Yes, that's everything for today. I know it wasn't the biggest Primark haul, but like I said, I'm trying to save money and I don't want to just go out and splurge for the sake of it, even though I definitely could have. And I'm going to be regretting that later. But I hope you all enjoyed it anyway. Um, let me know if you're going to get anything in the comments below or if you have any questions about anything, then just let me know. If you did enjoy today's video, then don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.